Good afternoon, Fortniters. It's Saturday, November 5th, and this video is coming to you in three parts. Part one, the vlog. So I'm actually not like Nicole, and I actually think that I am going through a quarter life crisis right now as well. And I don't know what to do about it. Um, so many things in my life have changed in the last few years. I moved from Pensacola to Boston. Um, so, you know, going from a small town to a big city where I knew absolutely no one. I started grad school, you know, and that was a really big change in itself. And it was great that I made that step. But now I'm kind of realizing that, like, everything I thought I didn't want in my life, I actually do want in my life. And so now I'm in school and I'm kind of, you know, like, ready for life to be happening. I've, like, got enough experience under my belt to actually be doing the job I want to be doing. And I'm still in school, so I can't you know, move on <laughs> to getting a job unless I decide to abandon school, but I only have a semester and a half left and, you know, my thesis is just kind of like, bam, like there on top of my head and I don't really know what to do about it. And I'm ready to be, you know, financially stable and just in a much better situation than I'm in. I'd like to have things like a job. Um, that would be great. Um, I'd like to have a pet but I'm not financially stable, so I'm doing the responsible thing and I don't have a pet. Um, plus, you know, I don't know if I'm going to be moving after I graduate. So, it, you know, I don't even know if I'm going to be going overseas. I might go on vacation. I might go visit my best friend in the Netherlands. I don't know. So there's a lot of I don't knows right now. Um, and there's also, you know, like I, I like things like a relationship. And, but there's a lot of things in life that I really want right now that... I can't have and that I have to wait for it and I don't like having to wait for it and so it makes me kind of stagnant um, and my classes are a little directionless this semester and so that furthers my stagnancy and so I'm just kind of like alright life let's get started I'm ready to rage like let's kick life's ass and move on and I can't and I don't know what to do about it. And I don't know where I'm going. And it kind of sucks. Part two. So I'm horrible at truth or dare. So Russell, I'm sorry that you have to come after me. I would like to know if there were one thing in your life you would go back and change that you think could change any, you know, the complete course of your life, what would it be and why? I dare you to call someone who you have not contacted, um, but you really want to, um, and record that. Give us the frame of reference, and uh, I dare you to contact that person. If it's because you haven't talked to them in a long time, or if it's because you um, want to get to know them better, you know, maybe... Uh, you met them in a bar and, you know, you exchanged numbers but never contacted them, call them. Part three. That was a tanuki suit made by a friend of my roommates, and that was so much fun! Oh, ah. 